Manola is a little community just outside of the city of Syracuse. We're a bedroom community and it's just a wonderful place to raise a family. It's the best kept secret in Onondaga County. We've been involved with Manoa for a number of years now. We started working with them on their greenhouse gas inventory. And then when this Clean Energy Communities program came out, we approached the village to let them know what the actions were because they had already completed a couple of them. They were kind of the guinea pigs with the street light conversion. We actually started doing our lights in all our buildings. The LEDs were so new, they were back ordered for a while, so it took some time to get them. And then little by little, we started converting all our buildings into LED on the inside. And when we heard about the NYSERDA grant, and what we could save by doing the street lights, it was a no brainer. I mean, it was the next step to go for. So within six months, I got a letter stating, geez, what's going on in Manoa? In this period, you're, you're using less than half of what you normally use. What's going on there? And we just said, LEDs. You know, we switched our street lights to LEDs. Right now, we're going into our fire base, talking about our energy efficiency with our LED lights inside the building. They're all motion detected as we walk out. As we walk across the bay, the next section will come out, and then before you know it, all the lights in this area will be on. I wanted to get involved where we could be someday self-sufficient, so we had to find ways to help ourselves. By the, the things that we've been doing, we're able to find those savings where we can maintain the services that we offer to our residents. The village of Manoa, being the first community in central New York to become designated, earned a $100,000 grant for an additional clean energy project, which they used for new equipment at their wastewater treatment facility. We're at the wastewater treatment plant. We took an old facility that was failing, and what we did is we turned it into a research facility. We do a lot of third world research here for countries that don't have wastewater treatment facilities. We're in the main pump house for the treatment plant. And what you're seeing here is an extremely sophisticated computer. We can use a very large pump, but only use a very small part of electrical usage. We trim the electrical cost dramatically. NYSERDA has been a great advocate of the energy resources for the village. They educate you more on the energy efficiency that you can bring back to your community. 